will. Chance for Campbell. Well, Howard shoot from it. He's thinking about it. He's decided instead to bend it in. Great delivery. Christian Dennis for the header. Into the arms of Cowan in the end. Yeah, he'll use his pace. I've said to that about Mulkey, even before Christmas when I used to come along, John. Mulkey's got that talent to get down the line. Well, he's just put a good ball into the box, which has landed kindly for Phil Jevons in the inside the box. He's teasing up instead for Flat. He just couldn't get the shot away. He seemed to hesitate at the crucial moment. The county had lost the ball and lost that momentum. And what a chance that would have been. It would have been a good chance as well, John. And I was just going to mention one thing to you as well. Danny East, the goalkeeper, John, he was only third choice, you know, at Colwyn Bay. They had Sam who was the fourth choice. It's Dennis now. Dennis. Dennis. This is a chance. Can yes. you Kelvin Blow, but Josh Green's lost possession halfway line. That's careless from the former Market Drayton man. Dennis, though, equally careless in possession, has given it straight to Thierry. Now Briggs, the player manager, through the gap for Ennis. Ennis with the layoff. This is good football by Staley Bridge. And now a chance for Abadaki across the face of goal. He hits the post and goes out for a goal kick. And he's referee as well today. Uh, Jacobs with the long diagonal ball just held up in that stiff breeze Dennis Jevons Dennis oh it's clever from Dennis as he tries to create the opening it will land for Nicky Platt though we'll play it out to the wing now for Duxbury there are five or six in the box to aim at Duxbury's yeah. over the cross the and it's gone in well did he mean it nobody cares County have doubled their lead and Scott Duxbury is scoring 2-0 absolutely unbelievable I think it was a bad mistake again by the keeper he went too far forward He's got to really, he's scored eight already this season, the centre half. Look at this for a run, oh goodness me, I don't go that far on the holidays. It's Platt to strike it, oh and it's just dipped over the crossbar, not to have a heart attack with two <laughs> Old County have got to move their wall. The referee should have spotted that. Jacobs heads it clear anyway, but it will end up being the first corner of the afternoon and it goes to Staley Bridge. And this is a big moment as well. Howard in swinger. Oh, it just misses the county man on the front post, Dennis. It comes out to the edge of the box now. Flat plays it back out to the wing for Ian Howard. He'll cross first time, left foot in. Dennis with a glancing header. Almost an own goal. It's come to Moke who drills it back in. It'll come to Cowan. Oh, he couldn't quite apply the finishing touch. We really don't want to see any more. It's, uh, Celtic coming forward. The booze are for McConnell. He's played a, played a clever ball down the line though for Kelvin Blow. Blow getting into the penalty area, trying to take on the fullback. But Cowan in the end, brilliant defending by Big Adam Cowan, shows him down the outside of the penalty area, and in the end he just runs out of pitch. But what a fantastic touch! I, I can't tell you, Phil, controlling that ball as it drops over his left shoulder, controlling it with his left foot. He must have seen it so late. Fabulous work again by Dennis, but it was offside, and that's allowed Staley Bridge to break down their left. This time, Abadaki holding it up, the forward Rochdale man. Turns it back to Charlie Ennis, or Paul Ennis, I suppose we should call him. Charlie is nickname. Gets the ball into the box, and he's found Abadaki, more by accident than design. He turns it back to Briggs, who will tee it up for Green. The shot's on for Green. They're standing off him here. Green on target. Spilled by the keeper. Abadaki's offside. It will not count. That, for me, Phil, is a controversial decision. For me, Abadaki timed his run pretty well. Ennis tucking in alongside Abadaki on the left. McConville tucking in from the right. So, what a fluid formation. Keith Briggs has got out there now. Here is Briggs. Oh, that's a late one. Nicky Platt's left his boot in on Briggs. Nicky Platt could be in trouble. Yeah, it's a good thing for Nicky Platt. Not a nice one, that one. 
McConville, I should say. Sorry, I thought it was Briggs. It's McConville that's gone down. It's McConville that's down. It's an end step one. It's not very pleasant. Referee Mr. Johnson's got the uh, Nicky Platt over there right away. And just as you were saying, McConville looks the most dangerous player. Yeah. Nicky Platt's left his boot in. Stockport County fans from this main stand. Here's the nearest to it. He's going to be booed.